Garden Club leaders at Regency Park Primary School. I'm Alana. And I'm Chloe. I'm Monica. It's Kiara. And I'm James. And we want to tell you about our plans for an edible garden. At the moment, we only have a small garden. It doesn't produce very much and it's quite crowded. So we are applying for this grant because we would like a bigger area and we'll be able to do even more. Now that's really exciting. surveyed the whole school and believe this is the best area to develop our edible garden. We'd like to have three garden beds, 15 centimetres high. They will be three metres long and one metre wide so the children will be able to access them easily. We want to put pavers in between them so the ground doesn't get muddy. But fortunately we already have the pavers. We want to put a compost heap over here so, and encourage all students and parents to use it. Because we are so close to the shed, it would be great for we could catch all the runoff and use it for the garden. So this is where we would like to put the water tank because we would like to save every drop. The Garden Club operates every Monday and Friday lunch times. We get lots of kids to help us care for the garden and look after the plants. They love it. We get them to pull out weeds, dig up the garden, and watch the plants grow from little seedlings into fully grown vegetables. With our new garden, a lot more classes will be involved. They will be rostered on so they have ownership of the garden too. When the vegetables are ready to be picked, the <laughs> We want the parents to be involved as well. We need them to help the teachers make beautiful lunches from all the lovely food that we produce. We, need, we know there will be so much food left over that we will need to sell some to the parents. We will, the money that we collect will be purchased to use to purchase further seedlings. We know that South East Water can offer us a lot of help to our school, so we would like you to come and talk to us about how we can save water even more and love every drop. You have seen what we would like to do at our school. We hope we are successful so we can have a lot, uh, lots of fun in the garden and grow lots of great vegetables at our school. Love every drop! Done. Okay. Water is precious. Save every drop. Preserve it. Conserve it. This waste has to stop. Turn off your taps. Take two minute showers. Install a garden tank to water your flowers. Use water from bucket to clean your car. Recycle water can fill a pool or spa. Buckets under shower heads can catch any leaks and reduce your bill over several weeks. Your washing machine should be full to the brim. Don't turn it on in a thoughtless whim. Avoid running water in basin or sinks, but take responsibility and start to think. Grow your own veggies for water from the can. Water saving devices are part of the big plan. Choose drought resistant lawns, plants and trees, and the burden in the dams will start to ease. <laughs> In a vast dry continent such as ours, we have to make good use of nature's showers. What is the good gold is essential for life. Love every drop or we may end up in strife. Every drop!